today was the best. Today was the best day. So, so, so. Um, let me tell you about my day. Today, we uh, did a whole bunch of stuff. We walked around the con floor. I took some video, a little bit of video, talked to some people that were really, really nice. And then I went into the vendor room. And that's kind of when my day took a turn for the best. So the first artist inside of the door, and I'm going to be up to, uh, uploading a YouTube video that is an interview with this gentleman, Master Jay Wood, I believe his name is, had some great prints, and I purchased two of them. And then I got talking to him about streaming and why I liked his art and, you know, just things that you talk to people about. And, I don't know, I ended up doing an interview with him. So I'll update YouTube with that video of the interview with him. You should check his stuff out. It's really good. Then I went to another vendor booth by the names of Two Girls and a Con, which consists, uh, one of which, of cosplayer Miss Pepper Potts. And that's one of my senpais, one of the reasons that I came to this particular convention in the first place, one of the leading causes. So that was awesome uh, to meet her. And I didn't just get an autograph. Well, I did. I got an autograph, and I met her, and I told her, you are senpai, you are best, blah. I purchased some of her stuff, and I posted that on Facebook. You should check their store out, their Facebook page out as well. They make some good kawaii-as-fuck products, and I'm sure you will endorse them highly and enjoy them. But, so that happened, and I, you know, I left, and I, I went away. Checked out some other people, talked to them, took some more videos, some more pictures, etc., etc., then I headed back to the vendor room and met a gentleman by the name of Ethan Van Siver. And Ethan Van Siver, for those of you who don't know, is a pretty renowned DC illustrator. And he illustrates and has illustrated for things in the past such as uh, Green Lantern, Blackest Night, and uh, the reboot of the Flash series pre-New 52. He was one of the main illustrators there, often works with Jeff Johns. They're pretty close. And that's great. So I met Mr. Van Siver, and I noticed he was taking commissions. And I said to myself, Mr. Van Siver, how I would love for you to make a full body image of me for the right price, you know, and your price is right. And so he says to me, okay, sure. What is this for? What do you want me to, to, to draw you in as, about, around, etc.? And I said, this is for a body pillow, something that I promised some viewers, and put me in a sexy pose, making a sexy face, and I want to be in a kigurumi. So Mr. Van Siver currently is probably working on that as we speak. It's about 1 a.m. here on Saturday night, which is really early Sunday. So that bo those body pillows that I promised you are going to come through with the art of a legend. And I am extremely excited about that. Um, <laughs> could not be more excited to deliver that to you. So, afterward, I was able to get in contact with a cosplayer that goes by the name of Klee Shea. And I wanted to do an interview with her. I knew she was only going to be there for Saturday. And I, you know, also came to this to this convention largely because of her as well uh, to meet two of my senpais and so I didn't fully expect her to respond on social media you know uh, me being just a person and she being you know fairly well renowned very well renowned actually in the cosplay community extremely well renowned so I mean like why would she respond to me and she did um, so she did and that was great um, and I did an interview, and I should be posting that to YouTube as well. Asked some fairly straightforward and basic questions. But again, I'm new to this, so what would one expect? But it didn't really end there. After the interview, which probably took a half an hour or so, we kind of just talked. And it was a really good conversation. It was very nice to talk to her and learned a lot more about her, and it was very nice. And, you know, it was coming around the time to talk about, you know, like, well, so what are you doing tonight? Blah, 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 I don't know. We should do dinner. Let's do dinner. That'd be very nice. And it was. So, um, she invited Miss Pepper Potts, who she knows as well, 
and they're all very close friends and some of their close friends and we had dinner at Benihana together and it was really great and um, I have been slowly dying of excitement all day except for the fact that my life is exactly what I dream it to be like oh gotta stop nope can't be a fanboy. If I one day want to be a senpai, I can't be a fanboy. And I'm finding it incredibly difficult. So, I had dinner with two of my cosplay heroes. Conversations were had. Such good people. Um, this convention was so worth the drive. So worth the time and so worth the money. Oh boy. Can't wait to get those body pillows for you. But I do have to drive back to St. Louis tomorrow. And I need to get to sleep tonight, sometime, whenever that happens. But yeah, I guess I'll get to sleep now, and I will have a safe drive tomorrow. I'm not sure if there's anything going on Sunday morning that's going to be extravagant or, or anything like that, but I will probably hang out and then head out somewhere around 2. I'll be back in St. Louis sometime within the half a day. I won't be streaming on Monday as I'll be editing these videos, though you wouldn't get that announcement until well after that time. So I'm too tired to realize that there's time shift and parallax and all sorts of things, but I guess I should get to bed. One day I'll be a senpai. One day. <laughs> How is this possible? My life is too good. Well, see you soon. Bye.